Hey, starting a new episode in the same room we did last time. But it's not the same episode, I swear. W wait, just a moment. It's a time for a sticker. Power smash. Hammer a single enemy using a lot of attack power. Mario, it's scary out there. Take this with you. It's called a badge, and it's incredibly helpful. You see, depending on the badges you have equipped, you'll get much more powerful. What's in... Oh, God, sorry. Is impor What's important is knowing what the effect will be when the first when you first equip a badge. Would you like to practice equipping it? No. Use FP to use a thing. Enough tutorial for now. Stuff that I mostly don't think I need help with. Oh god, I can't find it! Okay. <laughs> we have one bit to spend, and I got it. Where this the power smash 2 FP required to... Oop. Use this attack, which lets you whack an enemy with... Great power, wearing two or more of this of these badges requires more FP to the, for the move, but increases the attack power. Oh, so you can stack multiple now. I don't think that worked last time. You need to spend badge points on those, which I much valued. Would like more BP, please. If you got that BP, spill it. I need it. <laughs> uh, oil spill jokes. This is... Don't do that. <laughs> Welcome to the home of Merlin, the Super Magician. I foresaw your arrival. I can aid you if you wish. With three Shine Sprites, I can power up your partners. Of course, that means I boost their attack power, but I also throw in a new move for free. So, which partner would you like me to power up? Huh? You don't have enough Shine Sprites. Be gone, come back with more. Shine sprites. Now we have incentive to get those. The door just falls on the ground when you go into a room. And just comes back up. Oop. Whoa. That was spookums. I saw a weird seam. Yeah, you can. when I'm over here, you can see this like, as I'm walking. Yeah. You can definitely tell that the middle part isn't with the rest of it. Like there was a seam of some kind. And once I get up close, I uh, still didn't expect this. <laughs> <laughs> I'm pulling another card trick today and making tons of loot. But somebody started tailing me, so I came in here to hide out for a while. I need to stop doing variations of that voice. Don't tell anyone you saw me or I'll bonk you. This is what this whole game looks like. <laughs> oh my god. You almost look like, uh, the, like Deku Link. I have tried to find like any kind of like little figure of Deku Link. I want it, but he just, it's, there's none, except for one based on the remake. But the art style's fucked up, and I don't like it. They, they messed up the, what was appealing about the character's design in the remake. I'm like, no, it's wrong. Hey, my name is Darkly. I like dim places, and I'm immediately doing the same voice again. And now I'm done talking for now. That's a Darkly. He loves the dark. He just stays here in the shadows all day long. Sounds kind of creepy to me, but hey, whatever powers you up. Know what I mean? Yeah. That's the powers you up is the Mario version of whatever floats your boat. You think he could just... I guess he doesn't have a house? Because like if he had a house, he could just... Uh, I, got a, I got a star thingy. Wah! Wah! Yeah! Woohoo! De yeah, I definitely slowly went further in a direction. Can I keep going further? Ah. Hmm. I've got two star pieces. I can actually power someone up relative quickly. Relatively soon. I can see down the hallway that they won't let me through over there. That's interesting. But I like the rotating camera. The item shop, I assume? Yep. Welcome! Uh, yes, welcome to Toad Bros Bazaar! Yeah, 
I mean, I can't, I can't give Toads a different voice. This is what they are. Is that an evil Bowser head? What? Summons a scary spirit to chase some enemies away. The Fright Mask. Hey there, fella. Welcome. Is this your first time in our shop? I think it is. I always like to explain our shop point system to new customers, so bear with me. Oh, God. Oh, is it a mustache? I thought he was just, like, horrified. Scared mouth. Customers receive one shop point for each purchase they make. You, you with me so far? You already lost. You, al uh, you already lost. Lost. Already. Wahoo! You already. I can't. I can't. I don't. I. Don't, I, 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 can't. I. For some reason, I can't even slightly do a Mario, at all. All of a sudden, with 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 already. Save up enough shop points and you can get prizes, including some rare items. You'll find a list of prizes posted in any shop, so be sure to check it out. Pretty simple promotion, won't you say? God, never explain anything to me twice. Jam and jelly. Three gold bars. Damn. Well, I'm gonna leave. Bye. Wahoo! It's-a me! You already lost me. I can't do it. It's-a me! You already something about you already is like such a weird mouth space that I immediately can't even try to. All I can do is do a vague high voice, but that's not the same thing. Cooking place, breaking into old granny's plate. Oh yeah, the granny's outside. Breeze, you two, not another step. Don't come this way. I lost my contact. <laughs> Some complete jerk just bumped into me and made me lose a contact lens. Oh my god. <laughs> I was right? I'm looking for it right now, so don't you dare move. You hear me? Whatever you do, do not move an inch. Not an inch, you hear? I'm gonna immediately step on a contact lens. <laughs> ah! Idiot! You stepped on it. My poor contact lens. I told you not to move. Don't you stupid ears work? What were you thinking? This is your fault. Now I have to buy a new contact lens, but you're gonna pay for it. That'll be the other 50 coins now. Compensate me, Mr. Cl my Mr. Clumsy. Fine. If that's your plan, then here's mine, you oaf. Yeah, I'm gonna block the gate to the west side until you bring me a new contact lens. Like from the store? Probably. Wait, did he say east side? What's that? Sleepy sheep. You know these are contact lenses. Kinda look like an Uzumaki. Alright, I guess what's 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 called a Naruto Uzumaki, specifically. Or it's called a Naruto. The the white thing with the swirl. Listen, this is a huge secret, but I gotta tell someone. I'm a wanted Goomba. I was a thief in another town, up until about three months ago. Yeah, a good one. But then the heat came down and I needed to hide out, so I came to Rogueport. They'll never suspect me being here with the thieves. Now that I told you, you gotta keep it a secret, okay? <laughs> I'm so sly. That's Magoomba. A Goomba, obviously. I think maybe he's on the lamb from somewhere. I mean, why else would he be chilling in this back alley? It's nasty here. On the lamb. What a strange term. Unfamiliar, it's just weird. Never I guess I guess I don't really know what the lamb is. There's no bee. So I don't know what a lamb without a bee even is. Dang, yesterday I blew through a hundred coins at that parlor, you believe that? But not next time, man. I'm coming back a winner. The odds favor me now. That's a suspicious Dugan. He craves that one big score, but I doubt it'll happen. I mean, even if he did make some money, he'd just blow it. He depresses me. Wow. You're just over here to judge on everybody, right? I guess that, that is your tattle skill. That's the type of person you are. Can I just slip in there? 
I made a paper. Let's get in there. Just... Who is wanted? It's hard to make out. It might be like a... A Koopa... In a cowboy hat with a bandana around his neck. Oops. Uh, fancy meeting you here. You're pretty dang persistent, buddy. What a pain. Fine, fine, okay, you got me. I'll give you your coins back, here. Are you, though? Oh, wow. Why is the floor covered in toilet... Uh, and it's, it, the floor's covered in newsprint. Like, it makes, it makes you look like you're just, like, putting it down so pets can poop everywhere or something. Let me give you a news flash. Even the innocent looking people in town are thieves. So don't come grumbling to me about losing a po little pocket change, okay, buddy? How do any of you have anything if all you do is take from each other forever? There's no producing, just taking. Those poor toads at the shop, like, how do they, like, do they ever go outside? Hey, that, that looks like a Nuzumaki. Or a Naruto, or whatever. Fuck. Probably just, I guess it's just a flower. Just right to the noose. Ha! <laughs> Woo -hoo! Gotta die fast. No. Look, I'm not letting you into the west part of town until you buy me a new lens. She should say west. Sorry, but end of story. I can't cook anything without my contact lenses in. Ah! My rage is so hot right now, I could cook you with it. Oh. So it's two for one. You find the contact lens, and that makes you unlock that side of town. So it makes you it makes it so you don't like sit here and spend so much time getting lost in this town, getting too going too far in each direction, and so on. Uh, but it also means you get a new ability, a new utility, a new because uh, so suddenly it, new people show up here. Because like ah yes, now that I've uh, got my contact lens, I can finally cook again and do my job. Yep, pretty much gotta pay those ten coins now. Nothing else to do. One, two, three. Yep, that's ten coins, all right. You can pass. I guess I should have tried to fight him. Can I still try to fight him? Maybe next time. This is East Rogueport. This is the turf of Ishnail and his crew of Rabos. The east side's all run down. You can't even tell if it's these buildings are vacant or not. If you're down here, you darn well better have a compelling reason to be here. That's Swindle. The ba the bandit. At least, I hear he's a thief, but I've never actually seen him steal. I guess that means he's good at it. He's always whispering to Arfur about something. Is that Arfur? That trouble center is the only place on the east side that with other, other townsfolk claim to. If the place is open when you're in the neighborhood, you should drop by. That's Arfur. He's always hanging around here. He looks totally suspicious, but apparently he lives by some super stern moral code. He's all straight edge. Is that a gold chest? No, just a wooden chest. Locked from the inside. Trouble center. I'm out of the office, please come again. But I'm in trouble, whether you're in the office or not. <laughs> it's a really big lock. Seems kind of like a big deal to me. Did I just pay 10 coins to get into this place and there's nowhere to go? Why did I do that? It looks like... Yeah, that's the thing I saw before. So I guess I turned into a paper sailboat at some point, too. So I'm a bit all about the origami. Was there a pipe back towards where we started?
Is Big O McBad Man still here? Oh my god, look at him. Hey, you're Mario. Wow, this is so cool. I never thought I'd meet a celebrity out here. Ooh, I know. You want to make an investment, Mario? My name's Lumpy, and I'm heading out to dry, dry desert to prospect for oil. I've lived my life hoping to get rich quick, and now my chance has come. But I still don't have enough startup funds. Can you please lend me some money? I'm accepting initial investments of a hundred coins or more. <laughs> no way, bub! I don't, have, I don't have it. Fine, whatever, be that way. Be that way, god. I'll be able to travel through there eventually. Are all the dudes gone? Waha! It's like a satellite dish with a fast forward symbol on it. What's up with that? What's the deal there? Who, me? Well, I'm a bit... I'm a bit down. My older brother left port just the other day. I wonder how he's doing now. I just hope he comes back in one piece. Because he's... Is he a pirate? In one piece. Yo ho ho, take a bite of gum gum. Okay, I'm legitimately actually kind of unsure of where to go now. <laughs> Do I go back in the dungeon? Oh, you want a contact lens, you say? Just wait a minute. Alright. Uh, oh, fuck. <laughs> they just sell them? Gee, fella, I'm sorry, but we don't have any in stock right now. Tough luck, I know. I can special order you one right away for you, but it'll take a while. Check back soon, okay? Hmm. I know how to spend a while. I'm a genius. Oh, where in the world could Princess Peach have gotten to? This is quite troubling indeed. Hopefully she takes out the other contact lens. Spending all day with one contact lens is a horrible feeling. You gotta, I, I would pretty much spend the time with, with one of my eyes closed. Because seeing through two eyes that see differently at the same time is just like, it's just a headache. So just passing time is not enough. So we don't have a contact lens, so we can't go to the west side of town. And there seems to be nothing to do around any of this place. And then even when I went into the berry that you pay, you pay coins to get into, there was nothing there. So maybe I just need to go back in the pipe and just hope there's some new place to go. I a little bit lost track of how much progress we've made. I'm just going to really quickly save just in case it's been a while. And then we'll challenge that guy and get our asses kicked probably. I imagine there's consequences to challenging gangs. But hey, you don't have to pay 10 coins each time anymore, which already made it so I couldn't invest in oil. Which could easily be a huge mistake anyway, but whatever. Hey, can I take you? What? You gotta, you gotta be kidding. You think you can fight your way through here? I'm gonna make you eat your words, tough guy. Let's get this party started. <laughs> How much HP does he have? 80? <laughs> nice. 
That's Gus. He's super annoying and tries to take tolls from everyone. Max HP is 20, attack is 3, and defense is 0. All in all, it's pretty tough. Oh, I've told you a million times, but that pointy spear of his hurts if you stomp on it. I wonder if this guy watches people pass 365 days a year. Talk about a workaholic. Ooh. Okay, so he has as much health as both of us combined. We do have 10 each, there's that. But he does, he does 3 damage, and I don't. I do have that now. But don't jump. Now we can do a smash. Four damage, that's good. Ow. Tried to hit B in time, it didn't work. Oh. She hurts herself by jumping. Ha <laughs> ha. Yeah, she'll hurt herself if I jump on her on him, which is not good. Oh. <laughs> the thing happened again. Oh, crap. Now she's not doing so great. Why the map, though? Oh, God. We're missing so many important things! Ow. Oh, damn it. Ah, oh, shit. Not the best. Yeah. Winky. Love you guys. Best bet. Ow. F crap. Because which one of us is in the front affect who gets gets hurt, basically? That's interesting. Wink. Hey. Let's focus on A for now, because B wasn't working. Huh? That hurt? You have no chance of beating me, trust me, so you better run. Yeah, if you don't, go seriously, it'll be game over for you. You can choose run from your tactics menu. They're even warning you, like, hey, maybe run from these kinds of situations. How much damage do I take from jumping on them? She doesn't have a lot more to do besides that. One. I think she only hurt herself, too. I don't think it did anything to him. Whoops. I guess I should have expected that. But anyway. Ooh. 22. Crud. You dumb video game heroes always pull this stuff. It's ridiculous. You think violence solves everything, do you? Huh? Don't ya? Yeah. Oh, look how tired he is. Poor Mario. Still don't have a key, though, huh? Well, don't have to fight him again, at least. I think it's time for me to go back to the end, though. And then I guess we'll hop back in the pipe and see if I can find a different path? They did mention that there was a pipe that goes to the town, but I thought we'd go to a different part of town to find said pipe, was the idea. Like a different pipe, not the same pipe. Oh, well. Ding, ding, 
Ding, ding, ding, ding, ding, ding, ding, ding. Woohoo! Ha ha! Hee Woohoo! Tried to explore the town, didn't find crap. Well, I did. I found a few things, but not our goal. Blorp, blorp, blorp. Hey, you weren't here before. My name's Dazzle, and I collect star pieces. The more I collect, the happier I am. So, guy, if you have any star pieces, I'll trade you my badges for them. Yay! Come on, let's trade. I'll do it. Which badge do you want to trade for? I don't have three. Change the sound effects of, of Mario's attack. So that's fucking pointless. Chill out. Never succumb to a first strike. Oh, that's kind of neat. When Mario's attacked, cause enemies to sometimes miss. That's a pretty good one. Slowly and automatically restore FP. HP. Ally. Huh. Heal more after battles. What? You changed your mind? So lame. Well, I don't... I, everyone always is like, yeah, you changed your mind? Like, no, I, I gotta see your prices and then find out, oh. Don't got that. I have an important part of com commerce is when you don't got the money. Ah. Just kidding, I'm gonna hit you. <laughs> nice. It's important to bully them. That's a spiky Goomba. A spiky headed Goomba. What a creative name. That spike is super pointy. So it's better to hit it with a hammer than jump on it. Maximum HP is two. Attack is two. Defense is zero. The addition of the spike means you'll get hurt if, if you'll hurt your feet if you jump on it. Duh. I'm gonna jump on it. No. I like the music with the violin and whatnot. Oh, ow. What is up with that mechanic? Is it just the hammer or other things too? It's just a kind of a thing that comes out of nowhere and isn't really acknowledged. I'm like, what's up with this? It's kind of a whatever thing during certain fights where it's like a big conflict and it's like, who knows what's gonna happen? Okay, so you can definitely break those cracks later, right? Seems like it. Uh, that's spooky. At first, it just happens in whatever time and with whatever place. You're like, okay, bonus damage to everybody. It's fine. This is a, a fighting situation anyway. But then you're... Um, other times, you're fighting a dude you just one-shot, and you're not going to take any damage in that fight. So it's really disappointing when the backdrop comes down and damages everybody. You're like, no, this was supposed to be a, a free thing. So the D-pad opens up special pause screens. Oh, the D-pad on the GameCube controller is not... Great. It's like a tiny stubby thing. We have like a shortcut menu though. If you can remember the hotkeys. That thing's kind of soggy. Bloop bloop! Ouch, that hurt! Good! Oh. Oh my god, he's coming from the sky? That's not how water works. Who just up and whack someone's tootsies like that? Somebody with some serious moxie, that's who. Moxie doesn't taste very good, honestly. I prefer ginger beer. Uh, what would you look at that? It's some saucy mustached guy. He's in a world of hurt. Oh my god. I'll give him a taste of the old tentacle trample. 
Hey Mario, you remember what Professor Frankly told us, right? You can press Y to change your attack order. If your HP drops, you can press Y to put me in front. So, because yeah, whoever's in front gets the, uh, is the one who uh, gets hit, which is a really useful ability. They kind of bury the lead by it's being like, oh, it affects your attack order. It's like, yeah, but it does. But there's other things that are pretty important here too. That's a blooper. And a really super humongous one, too. Ew, it's all slimy. Don't you have to insult the man. I just totally can't stand slimy, nasty, icky things. G-R-O-S-S, -S, gross. Max HP is 12, attack is 1. It's weaker than the thing I just fought. Attacks with tentacles, Nink. Once you damage both its tentacles, it'll fall down. And then it's attack time. By the way, the tentacles each have 3 HP. Okay, that takes them up to, like, more... Uh, 18, and he might regenerate that with his phases. Now relax and how and how's house on that slimy nasty pe blooper? What do you mean? What does house on mean? Like beat on or something? House on that blooper? What did you say to me? I do not have this timing down at all. It can be rough, because the, uh... No photo hammer, you can't hammer that... Oh. I thought it was just in the background, I guess it's supposed to be high up. Hey, mustache! You're thinking I'd taste good, aren't you? Admit it. You seem to have some insecurities about being a blooper. Yeah, you want to snack on these tentacles, don't you? You know, I'd rather bloop. Gutless punk. Ow, shit. I was reading your dialogue and you attacked me. That's rude. I'm trying to do a let's play. Dick. I still can't, I can't do it. It's rough, because if you're bad at the mini games, the whole game, it just gets harder than it would be for another person. That's just like a significant change to how much damage you do or take every turn. And you're like, I don't know why the timing isn't working out. Help. Somebody help me. I don't know if I'm early or late. I wish the game gave me a hint. We almost got him. That was easy enough. He didn't even get a chance to get back up. Only 15 more and I level. Oh. Goodbye. That's right, kids. As Mario just taught us, random violence is the answer. If you just start fights with no people for no reason and make them cry and run away, then your solution will appear and you will reach prosperity for unrelated reasons. Hooray. Morals.